Hello, welcome back to our Gaming on the Budget Special Edition with Card Wars and Emily. We are <coughs> going to begin. We each have 25 hit points, and the goal is to reduce our opponent to zero. Extreme close up. That just happened. Great. <laughs> 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 right. So, um, our turn sequence are, we're going to ready all of our cards. Not going to happen right now because that's our first round. Um, then we will draw a card. We have two actions to spend. The action points for spending are up top on the card. The creatures will have an attack value and a defense value. And the text will tell us their special things, if there are special things. Um, so you play your two actions. If it's not the very first round with the very first player, then they get the choice of if they wanted to floop, um, then they can spend an action if they have one left over to draw a card. Then it's fight town, which does not happen in the first round, and then it ends the turn. So, Miss Emily, since we decided you're the cool guy, the cool guy. for the moment, you will be going first. So you draw a card. Okay, so I'm going to play <coughs> Patchy Pumpkin. And he's got a floop on him, deal one damage. And target creature, do this once for each cornfield landscape you control. They only target each creature once. That's cool. I'm also going to play the Wall of Ears. Ooh. How cute. Yes. One defense for each cornfield landscape in play. Counting all players. Well, I don't have any, but so that has a defense of eight at the moment. Yes. Yes, he does. All right. So then you spent both of your actions, so there's no drawing and no fighting. So that is the end of your turn. And on my turn, I will draw a card. And I will, let's see. No. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to put an extra large spirit soldier out. Each adjacent creature has plus one attack, but I don't have an adjacent creature yet. And then, I will put the pig out. And I do have the option, and I will floop the pig. <coughs> <laughs> Which will flip your cornfield. So now your thing's only a seven. Okay. That helps. I don't have any actions to draw. My apologies. And then we move on to fighting. Where things will happen. So, everything that's ready must fight. So, he's been flipped, so he won't be fighting. He comes this way. And then he'll flip. And then I will be able to defend you. Uh, you don't have to flip yours to defend. So, you will, he will not hit you for one because you're going to completely defend him. So... Both will deal damage to each other. The attack of its damage on the defender, yeah, equals to attack value. Okay. So, you'll get one. And I will get two. One. Two. And that is the end of my turn. So, okay. draw a card. Do 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 do. Don't 
dum bum dum bum bum Ooh, this chair is squidgy. All right, what are we doing? Okay, I'm going to use if if I have um, a zero, like for a rainbow card, then it is a free action. Okay, so I'm going to do my um, my rainbow building. Okay. There, and. Um, I'm going to reclaim this landscape. Oh, and nice. This is a spell. Mm -hmm. So I just put this like in a discard. Neat, you play it and then discard it. Okay, so. Probably next to your card deck. Okay, and that. Is that what you're doing? That was only one action. That's all I'm going to do. Would you like to spend an action to draw a card? I'm going to spend an action to draw a card. Okay. Now you must okay. attack. So now we attack and... Oh, oh wait, would you like to floop that guy? Oh. Deal one damage to target creature. Mm -hmm. That doesn't mean you, does it? Or does, does it does mean me at this point. Then I'm so I'm going to flip the Patsy Pumpkin, and this says that my creature in this line has one attack. Plus one attack. Defense. So, does that mean I lost him? Yes. It's got an attack, so you will be attacking with it. Oh. So, then. He will do threes of damage here and only receive ones of damage. And then I, has one damage, do this once for each cornfield landscape you control. So that's four for me personal. Good play. Good play. Now it's my turn. I will ready what creatures. I will draw a card. Okay. Oh, cool. That's actually really cool. So then I will do 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 do. Oh, okay. I think I'll play the embarrassing bard. I don't think I'm gonna flip the the pig this time, but so the pig actually has plus one attack from sitting next to the giant extra large spirit soldier, and that guy is just that guy. Do I want to flip him? No, oh, I don't want to flip him yet. So then I'm actually. Hmm. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. I'm going to play the Wood Talisman on him, which will give him plus two attack for this turn. Oh my, I apologize. So then we will just attack everything. <coughs> so then he's got a three attack on your pumpkin. Who can't, will not attack me back. The pig will hit you. For three. Yes. And then your cornfield creature will get hit for another one. Alright, that will be discarded. Right oh, it's here. you. So I grab a card and hmm. 
Kim doing? I'm going to play this Husker night. Okay. Do I put that on here? Or yeah, I guess whichever one works okay. for you. So I'm playing the Husker Knight, which has one attack and two defense for each cornfield landscape. And I'm also going to play Bigfoot. Okay. Mm. Where would you like to put him? Actually, you only have one slot. Well, okay. I'm going to put him here. Okay. And I'm going to flip him. And, and you're going to flip him. He will flip my target face down. What's flip that? target face down. Hold on, let me see. Is that the landscape? That's Hold on. Flipping? Flip target face down, landscape you control face up. Do I maybe not? Ah, uh, so I would flip him face down. And you would flip that back to face up. Like that? Well, no, um... But it's not face If down. I'd flip your cornfield, you would. Okay. And then... As it is, I don't know how to get my pig flipped back upright, so... <sighs> blah, 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 blah. So that was a zero action. What else are you going to be doing? Um, that's it. <coughs> Would you like to use an action to draw a card? This one was two actions, so I have no more actions. Oh, you played the husky knight. Duh. So I forgot you played those this turn. So then it's off to battle. Possibly close to it. Oh, okay. So, oh, you didn't ready. These guys would have. Ready these guys would have been other. ready. Um, when? Okay. So I would have had to flip them back. Yeah. Then, okay. Anyway, that guy is still a three attack, right? Okay, and then the cornfield. Oh, I get it. The so pumpkin. this person has just defense. Until us, you use him as a floop. You could have flooped him. I could have flooped and flooped him. Yep, yeah, but so. Okay. Oh, now he's only got one little defense left. And then, okay, and then he doesn't hit that guy. And let's see. Husker Knight has plus one attack. Put for each cornfield. So that's four. Oh man, I messed with my hit points. Yeah, I had four, right? So I should have eight now. So that would be my hit points. <laughs> I think we may play to like, I don't know. We'll see. So then it's my turn. I will. Ready my cards. I will draw a card. And yeah, teleport. Because that's going to be useful. Um. Hmm. Hmm. I think I will spend an action to drink some gnome snot. Mm. Draw three cards. Ooh, a punk cat. See, a Wodic Wanderer and a punk cat. Change lanes. Marauder. Hmm. Guess we'll play a punk cat for my second action. Um, my pig is that, so I'm gonna. Oh, I'm gonna flip this guy for a card. Another punk cat. And then we will attack. So this guy's gonna 
Take a single slash at your cornfield and, and then die. Cornfield. No, he doesn't kill your cornfield. Your cornfield is an eight. Yeah. Has plus one defense for all the cornfield in play. So it has this four. It has four, four plus four, four more. Oh, so it's only half dead. But how did your. It's only a little dead. Mine only has nine hit points. And you're hitting him for three each round. Do I have to ready my things each round? When it's your turn. Right now we're doing my fight sequence. But, but right this is my fight montage at the moment. Cue the song. Do, but do, if do, not ready, do. Then how do they fight? Huh? Answer me that. You're defending. But yeah. I'm defending, so how do yours get hit points? How do mine get hit? Yes. Because you're defending by like, you're like, oh yeah, like, oh yeah, I well, what you Okay, so this... It's like a parry. Or a counterattack. They like, go up against each other. And like, Mortal Kombat. I'm not sure I'm allowed to say that. But that's what happens. Anyway, and then the plains cat, or the punk cat, well... Attack. So nobody changed lanes. So he's just got two. Yes. So your two. Two points for your Husker Knight, who is also at like eight defense. So he gets two for each There's cornfield. Husker Knight has one attack and two defense for each cornfield. Okay. That you control. Why is there like an X next to the defense and fighting? Uh, because the X is a random, it's an unknown. It's, you know, back to your days in algebra when you were solving for X or Y or, you know, Natalie. <laughs> what? I don't, don't even, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> anyway, when you were, it's, it's a variable. It's a variable number, so... If you're, if this, then that X equals this. So if you have four cornfields, the X equals four. Or eight, in this case. Because that is an, you, this guy's a four eight right now. If I were to manage to flip this, he would then be a three, three six. Okay. And so on and so forth. So I have four... For fighting and yeah, eight which is why defense. you put, did a, took a four chunk out of my cat, and my cat bit you for like two tiny points because you're like, tss, tss, tss. I'm a punk cat. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> and <laughs> and uh, that's that's my turn. So ready your creatures. Okay. First time I've done that since we started. Don't forget Bigfoot. Oh, my Bigfoot. Leah! So now I draw Don't, a card. Now you draw a card. I wonder if my in laws be home. So if I place something behind something, then that also counts as like an extra defense, but not. Never mind. Nope. I'm stupid. Okay. I just don't understand the question. Are you talking about another creature? I don't think you can put another creature I can't put behind. Another creature behind another creature? No. Okay. You can put a building or a spell. A okay. I don't think you can put. I think it's just one creature per lane. There are spells that'll move your creatures. So I technically can't do anything. And. But what I can do is flip my pumpkin. Okay. And can so I he will deal one damage to target creature for each landscape, cornfield landscape you control. So that is four, which will almost kill my embarrassing bard.
All right. Now, do you want to draw a card? Spin an action to draw a card. I could do that. Yes, I could. Okay. Now attack. Okay, so now I attack. Yes. And I just exhaust all yep. my... So you're going to kill my punk cat. Who's going to give you two. And then those guys will stay hanging out. And then I guess that'll happen. Does, does that, that doesn't do anything. He's got an attack value. And then, personally, we'll get two hit points. We'll take two more. Therefore, I have three, six, nine. Okay, so, getting beaten up. I will ready my cards. I will draw a card. Um, hmm, 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 then I'll put out a Wodic Marauder, and I will I'm gonna leave him. I'm going to attack with these guys. And then do 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 we will do one damage to kill your patchy patchy pumpkin. Oh patchy pumpkin. <laughs> and then I will add three to your husker knight. So that only has one thing. And then I am done. Okay. So now I can ready my end. And get this card. Doing some heavy thinking over there. Or am I? Mm. Maybe I'm not thinking at all. Well, you are. I'm thinking. Winning. I am thinking. So obviously, we picked the right cool guy. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna play Cornatar. Cornatar. Cornatar, and when he enters play, I do one damage for each cornfield control. So, to the opponent. To your opponent. To opponent. Does that mean so you? So that's that means me. That is four to me. I like Cornetar. <laughs> <laughs> Six, nine, twelve, thirteen. So these my actions and. Okay, so that this doesn't get too long for a fun light game, we're going to play until I get to 15 hit points, and then we'll say she killed me, because uh, she's hit me for 15, and I've hit her for 3. Legit 3. So. Alright. So, um... No, actually, that, you're just going to straight up kill me at this fight. Oh, really? Yep. Right now? Your wall of corn will hit me for three. Wall of, wall of ears. Wall of ears, sorry. Your ear wall. And, uh, Fifteen. Oh, you got you me, dying. Jake. You oh. got me. Jake always wins. Right? Alright, and we will come back in just a minute for summary.